Hey guys, making a quick video. I'm, I'm about to leave, but I, I gotta sneak this in. It, it's been a pretty hardcore day, and so I'm, I, I'm not my normal, uh, off the wall, bouncing kind of self, so I'm a little bit more thoughtful because there's a ton of shit running through my head after 11 hours of this day, but I do want to talk about the uh, Amazon uh, acquisition of Whole Foods. Uh, I love it for many different reasons. July 5th, 1994. July 5th, 1994 is the day that Amazon launched. Whole Foods was valued at $220 million. Oh, you guys think I'm an amateur, huh? Uh, Whole Foods was valued at $220 million at the time. I'm always fascinated by being historically correct, um, which I talk about with myself and trying things. Being historically correct allows uh, the person that started way behind to win, right? To me, it's fascinating that it's Amazon buying Whole Foods instead of Whole Foods buying Amazon. Or the fact that had Whole Foods been run by people that bet on the internet and started with food instead of books, like would it be the other way around? Would would Whole Foods be eating up the world instead of Amazon eating up the world? There's a clip here that I'm gonna gonna show you right now that was from what, just like two or three weeks ago where I was talking about, yeah, yeah, where I was talking about Amazon, if it entered into the stereo world, what would it mean? I don't know if you know how Amazon does it. It would be Amazon buying Sonos and then selling Sonos is for half the price they're selling for right now to penetrate market share, and then you're really finished. I and mean, you guys saw what they do with bananas? You see this? Because they want to win grocery? They're giving away a million free bananas like in one day. Like they're just, they're, they're smart. I, I think people don't understand how big these companies are. I wonder how many people are like, whoa, Amazon bought Whole Foods easily. And, and when Facebook buys X and Apple buys Y, I don't think people understand what's happening here. The new world is gonna eat the old world. It's gonna eat it. It's gonna eat it, my friends. That's what's gonna continue to happen. And I think today is a landmark day because a new age company, Amazon is not old, a new age company, uh, you know, I was 19, I was 18, I was 18 years old when Amazon launched. This is not a new company. Uh, Excuse me, not an old company, it's a new company. Uh, Whole Foods itself is kind of a new company, but what this means to the other people in the grocery business, like this is, this is a shot in the air. Like I want people to pay attention. This clip is me talking about Amazon entering that world. Uh, and, this, and what I really want to talk about in this video is, one, if you're winning, start eating up your own self. Don't let somebody else do it. If you're winning right now in your business, put yourself out of business. Don't let somebody else do it, right? Don't let somebody else buy you, buy them. That's number one. Number two, please pay attention to what Facebook and Apple and Google have the capabilities of doing and start figuring out what that means to you and, and, and how you're innovating. And, and, and the thing, whether you're running a $100 business or a $100 million business that you take away from this, innovation always wins. If you're right, you always win. If you're right, you always win, right? Uh, Planet of the Apps, three real fucking A-list celebrities and me. How'd I get there? By being right by being right, by building my brand the right way that gave me the leverage to be on that panel. And so I just want to inspire somebody from this video to do the right thing on podcasting, to do the right Alexa flash, to to triple down on their ability on Facebook, to understand influencer marketing, to to see there's a white space in Snapchat while everybody thinks Instagram is pulling, you know, putting them out of business. Like, be smart. Be smart because if you're smart and you execute, you start buying things that started off way ahead of you.